So I'm kind of liking the colors in these, plus the little droplets in there. And uh, with this macro lens, you can get right up against them. Good morning. Uh, here I am at the Sepulveda Basin Wildlife Reserve. A uh, typical day would be me with a big lens trying to catch all these uh, birds back here, birds in flight and stuff like that. But today uh, it was cold enough that uh, and kind of there was enough dew on the leaves that I figured I'd give uh, this macro a little chance here. So. Here I am trying to get these little droplets on the leaves here, so let's see what uh, what we can come up with. So I'm just going to zoom in all the way one to one here and use this focus peaking feature here to kind of uh, really fine tune the focus on the droplets. There is some wind so which is going to make this a little tough but let's see what we have. Yeah, there's a little shake there, but I'll keep working on it. That's the thing with macro photography, man. Lots of trial and error. All right, so I found another cluster of leaves here that really piqued my interest. Just the colors and the little water droplets on them. So I'm going to try and take a picture of this uh, and then maybe I can share that with you and just look at the little fine minute details in it and uh, hopefully you enjoy it as well. Check this out. So I'm kind of liking the colors in these plus the little droplets in there and uh, with this macro lens you can get right up against them. Okay, so that's what I have. I'm at F18. Actually, I think I'll go to F16 here. And I'm just going to zoom in, make sure everything is perfectly in focus. I'm trying to get these droplets here really in focus. And I do realize there's a little bit of shake here, but I'll put the shutter speed high enough where it should freeze the motion. And there's an image. And one thing I learned is to, before leaving, I learned the hard way, before leaving just kind of zoom in, make sure everything is nice and in focus at least the part that you want. The depth of field is so tiny that you, as unless it's like on a totally flat plane, uh, you will get some areas that are out of focus. So that's the image. I'll see what it looks like in post, but so far in camera, it looks good to me.
So this here was what I was looking for. A bunch of mushrooms. Oh, let me get out of the sun. So this here is what I was looking for. A bunch of mushrooms, like uh, maybe a mushroom patch or something that I could uh, uh, take some pictures of. But it seems like they were all mowed down or something. So uh, I'm gonna keep walking around the field here. It's a nice day. Sun's barely coming out. It's still overcast, which is nature's little soft box. And um, hopefully I get another patch of mushrooms in here. Stay tuned. another patch nothing's piquing my interest here either off we go all right that's about it for today I didn't find the mushrooms I was looking for so I'm just gonna wrap it up uh, go and uh, pull up the pictures I already took on the computer and see and hopefully I got some nice shots Thanks for watching and I'll try and keep these coming more often and uh, have a great day. Thanks. Bye